question is not whether difficulties come or no. The question is how do we deal with them? Difficulties become worries if you don't know how to deal with them properly. Emotional quotient is all about how to handle these difficulties of life. Emotional quotient is also about how you deal with people. I know so many people who almost are completely controlled by others. Somebody presses a button, you start smiling. Somebody presses another button, you start crying. You know. That means your emotional quotient is very much affected and controlled by other people. So the question is, who are you? The question is, how strong are you internally? If you are so easily affected by the way others treat you, the way others deal with you, where is the, your emotional quotient and what is the strength of your emotional quotient? In today's time and age, the most impactive way of dealing with people and actually touching people's hearts is by the way you deal with them. There are four aspects of what emotional quotient is about. First is self-awareness. Second is self-management. Third is social awareness and fourth is relationship management. There are so many people from high-end institutes who are hired by the corporate, by the company, but after you hire a person, you realize that this person is useless. Not because he's academically not strong, academically very powerful, but socially not strong. Because ultimately, success in business is about success in relationships. There are people who are less academically qualified, but much more uh, productive not because they are intelligent, but they know how to deal with people. So unless you know your emotions, how will you develop a strong emotional quotient? So emotional quotient is about your ability not only to deal with yourself, but also to deal with the world. Those who don't have strong emotional quotient, they first of all struggle to deal with themselves. And then they naturally, as a result of inability to deal with yourself, you have inability to deal with others also.